What up, dudes? It's Pixel Tricks. Welcome back to Banjo Kazooie. So today we're going into our very first world, Mumbo's Mountain. <laughs> um, you might recognize the music uh, from here. Uh, yeah, there it is. Dun, 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 dun. It's so shenanigans. I love it. There are three new moves to learn in this world. Find my mole hills, and I'll explain. Whoa, your what? So, these are music notes. Uh, we collect these. I'm a note. One of a hundred in each world. Collect those to open the note doors. Yeah, so there it is. These little guys are called Jinzos, I believe. Oh, goodness. I'm too bad, though. Uh, yippee. You saved me. Grintilda is imprisoned. Five of us Jinzos in each world? Free us all to get a Jiggy. Yeah, so we just gotta find five of those little dudes. They're in each world. Pretty cute. Some basic stuff. Swim underwater. I'm not too good at it, though. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> it's been a minute. Still getting used to the controls on the Xbox. It's pretty good, though. Let's go ahead and grab these. And, yeah, I head on up this way. I just love... Like, there's so many nice little touches. Like, listen to the music now. And then you go underwater. Then it gets, like, all into the xylophone. It gets all, like, chill. I love that. It's so good. There's a bull. You can't kill him. I've tried everything. Ah, you just gotta... You can hurt him. He just gets salty, though. Yeah, you can knock him down, but... Oh, wow. I didn't let him even say anything. <laughs> I didn't even give him a chance. I didn't even give him a chance. Yeah, you can break those little guys and uh, get some honey if you need some health. So we're gonna head up here immediately because uh, we're gonna get a move that is gonna help us like a whole bunch. Should be right over here. Oh yeah, the hut two, three, four. It's so cool. They're like going along with the music. Oh, the jiggy right there. So yeah, in the worlds you can go and find uh, these little mole hills. And you'll find bottles, and he'll teach you a new move. Talent Trot. Look, Kazooie tackles steep slopes with ease. That sounds useful. How does she do it? Hold the right trigger, then press the left trigger. Continue to hold the right or left trigger while moving Kazooie around with the left stick. Go practice. Like this? Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, alright, so this is a Talent Trot. And we can, uh, control Kazooie, and she's much faster. Um, Kazooie's cool, because she's a strong woman of power. Uh, my kind of lady. Literally and figuratively, because she can, she can, like, hurl Banjo around on her back. It's pretty good. You must search for ten of us in each world. We'll help you progress through the witch's lair. Sweetness. I always thought she ate it. Oh, we got an achievement. Get jiggy. When you're ready to leave the world, return to the star area and stand on the exit pack. Get jiggy. Getting jiggy with it. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, so back here, there's a little mumbo token. We're gonna collect this. Me mumbo's token. Use for mumbo's magic. Yeah, we'll see all that in a little bit. But for now, we are going to collect these. Yeah, you need the talent trap for slopes like this. Because if you're Banjo, you just slide down. Like so. And it's just, it's so much faster, dude. <laughs> so, get used to that clucking. Yippee, you collected enough notes to break the first note door spell. Already, huh? That's cool. Yeah, you're not required to collect everything in the game to beat it. But, for games like this, I usually do. Just out of habit, you know? It's like... You do get a reward. I don't want to spoil it, but uh, you do get something for collecting everything. And it's actually rather useful. So I guess we'll go down here now. I mean, uh, Congo, I believe? Grr. This Conga is tree. Me hit bear with oranges. He's very mean. Hey, that's Conga's orange. Put it back. Now I need this. Yum. Oranges are nice. <laughs> nice text box right there. Oh, Chimpy like Congo's orange. Chimpy help fat bear and bird? Who you calling fat, Chimpy? You look like you need to gain some weight. So we get another Jiggy right here. Dude, we're getting Jiggies left and right, my dudes. 
gonna head up here and get some eggs. Egg, egg, egg. Where are the eggs? Kazooie can learn to use us as ammo. Like right now? <laughs> yes. I keep pressing B, but it's not B. It's X. Time for the buzzer to learn the ancient ways of the egg. I'm listening, Beetle Breath. Hold the right or left trigger, then press Y to shoot an egg out of your mouth. Hey, sounds cool. Anything else? Sure. Press B instead, and you can shoot them out of your ass. Sheesh. Sounds painful. I wish I'd never asked. Bird Brain can carry 100 eggs in her backpack. Oh, and you can also use the left stick to tame while you are crouching. Exciting, huh? Ah! Now that you've learned to use the eggs, here's 50 of them to practice with. Exciting. You silly. Alright, we'll use those in just a sec. First, we're gonna go up here and get another uh, Mumbo token. And we actually have a switch right here with Gruntilla's face on it, so naturally. Oh, we we don't have the right theme for it yet. We'll, we'll be back for this. That's fine. Well, first, uh, let's go ahead and use our eggs. Uh, on, on this mean monkey, dude. Be safe here. Oh, yeah? How about these? You can't hit Kong- I just did, though. Oh, you got me! Egg hurt, Congo. Sorry, dude. But you're too mean, though. Okay, hit him again. Do it again! Oh, he does not care. There we go. Oh, you missed- Oh! Bam, bam, bam. Yeah! Or bear beat Konga. Let me give prize to Bear. <laughs> and he gives us a prize. That's cool. We're kind of like related, kind of. Aren't we? Like, right? I guess he's a great ape and we're a bear. So, probably... Not... No. So, no, me. <laughs> Don't touch Konga's blocks. But I want to. So, yeah, we have to lead... We gotta get him to lead the shots, dudes. Not really. Just gotta stand on it. There we go. Gerp. Clever bear, find Kanga's gold. I found your other gold. Bam. Nice. Let's get out of here, dude. <laughs> Sweet. So now that we got all the Kanga stuff, let's just grab this. Wow, we're running through this, dudes. We're running. Who next? Oh, yeah, there's one more move we could learn in here. I believe it's right around this way. I'm gonna actually take care of. These ads right here with our roll. Check it out, dudes. I'm for glory. I'm roll spamming. I didn't really show off on all the moves because uh, we didn't do the tutorial. There's the crouch, the beak blast, I think it's called. The roll attack, the standing swipe. This one kind of has little range. But the most useful one is definitely this. The, like, talon attack. That's why Kazooie's so cool because she, like, has all the, all the good damage. All right, so... Let's go ahead, go up here, and break... Oh, we don't have our theme yet. Oh, it's right here, dude. It's right. Uh, dodge. I call this the Beak Buster. Jump onto the air, then press the right or left trigger. Send Kazooie slamming hard down to the floor. I don't like the sound of that, Banjo. Be used to a nest, girl. You'll be using it a lot. Whoa, Banjo, there's nothing more I can teach you in this world. Whoa, dude. One sec. So, yeah, it's like just pretty standard ground pound, as you can see. Pretty cute. Go ahead and we can unlock all the things in here. Grab this. Oh, goodness. I made it. I remember one of these are a troll. Like, you break one of these open, there's... Well, I don't want to spoil it. You'll see. Dude, it's a mega jump scare, dude. Check this out. No way. You got me. I, I destroyed that man's house. <laughs> there's just nothing left for him there. Oh, there's a Jinso. He was trapped. The green one. My favorite. Uh, we can break this. Oh, it's a one man. A one manual, if you will. Do I get this? And we get another jig. Pretty easy one right there. Got another Mumbo Token. Look at this. These things are all over the place. Now, the thing about the Mumbo Tokens is, uh, yeah, this one just in the eye. Um, can we get up here? Wasn't there a secret up here? It might not have been this world. Yeah, because I know where that one thing is. 
yeah, the mumbo tokens, you don't need to collect all of them, I believe. I believe there's extra ones in the game. I think that's like the only collectible that's like that. We Juju, Mumbo's totem pole. Feed us with nice blue stones. Like this? Uh-huh. And then they get faster. I remember having so much trouble with this when I was a kid. But you don't want to, you want to actually get on the second one. Look at this sneakiness. Yeah, so there are going to be two honeycomb pieces for, in each level. Ah, uh, I almost perfected it. Oh, no. Here's the last one that is the hardest. I don't know why they wanted to be fed those things. <laughs> it just skyrocketed them out. We already got seven. We are mega gnarly, dudes. Okay, so let's go ahead. Yeah, and like different areas have different, uh, like music themes and stuff. It's so cool. <laughs> this one's just kind of here. Oops. Yeah, I gotta definitely get used to this control scheme, but it's not so bad. Oh, this game's so fun, isn't it? Isn't it? It's so just chill. Chill a little collectathon. Grab some things. Uh, let's see. Let's go here. 87. And then these three. There's the fi final gin uh, Jinzo. We have four of those. Wow. Yeah, and they'll drop off a... Uh... Oh, yeah, and they do the in unison Jinjo. Oh, cool. We're only missing one. How perfect. Huh. Now, I believe... Yeah, that's where it was. It's up here. So we have to like drop down like so. And there's the final one of that. Alright. Yeah, because there's going to be two honeycomb things in each world. Like I said. So we already got those. Those are kind of like the harder, more sneaky collectibles to find. Uh, as you can see. And we're just about done here. Oops. Oh, yeah, ha, ha. Get away from me. You freak. What even are you? You're just a troll monster. Oh, he got over it. <laughs> he said he was trying to impress his friend. He wasn't really down to scrap. He saw that I turned around. He's like, ah, never mind. All right, so this is Mumbo's hut. Uh, right here. You may have saw him earlier in, like, the cutscene. And he was trying to uh, get down with um, Grintelda. Uh, I don't blame him. She's pretty fine, though. I, I got to give it to him. Wake up. Mumbo, wake up. Me Mumbo, best shaman in all game. Can help Banjo and Filthy Feathered One. Watch it, hot boy. Mumbo's magic tokens. Uh, hid by witch, find tokens, and Mumbo help you. Banjo not got enough tokens for Mumbo magic. Look at sign. Green more. Okay, Mumbo. Facts about Mumbo. Uh, his mask was originally supposed to be a plot point in the game. Uh, it, it was going to be, uh, his mask was a spell put on by Gruntilta, but they scrapped it uh, last second. And in Banjo 2, you can actually see it's, uh, it's like infused to his head in that game. And this is just a mask. But yeah, the final Mumbo token is not in here. Sometimes it's up there. I guess we need all of them for this, uh, this round, that's fine. The other one's pretty easy to get. We just gotta get in here. I believe there is actually a way to glitch out uh, this mountain. Not Mumbo's but this thing right here. Hey, ugly. No bears allowed in Tinker's Tower. Oh, it's Tinker's Tower. So we can only get up so far before we fall, as you can see. So it's no good. Uh, we gotta find something else to get up there, dudes. So we're gonna go ahead and go back to Mumbo now that we have five tokens. And we're gonna see our very first transformation. Wake up! Ah, Banjo has plenty of tokens. Stand on skull and press X to see mighty mumbo magic. Like this? Uh, eh. Baga, baga, bagu, baga. <laughs> oh, mumbo jumbo. Mumbo's magic free to change back. You came when ready. Uh, termite bit small, but not bad for first spell. Mumbo magic practice needed. Oh, fine. Oh, look how happy he is. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna go back to Banjo really fast. Gubaga. Gumanets. 
Yeah, that's what he's saying in the end. Umanitz. It's buddy. Alright, so before I forget, let's just go ahead and I'm gonna head right back over here to that switch that we saw before. Because now we have the proper uh, move to actually activate it. So these switches are found through every level of the game, one each. And what they do is when you ground pound them, um, they unlock a certain uh, area or, well they all do uh, different things. But this one just uh, straight up like shows you a jiggy location. So I'll show you right here. I'm gonna go here and ground pound. Then I hit the switch and there you go. Then a jiggy will appear at the top of the beginning. But um, we can't get it even with talent trot. So we need to go and transform into the termite. Uh, but we're gonna finish out this level first. Yeah, you can actually take your transformation uh, transformations outside of um, the level. Just not very far, but uh, like a little bit. And this one is required to get the jiggy. All right. Let's go ahead and get my Uma nuts. Yeah, listen at the end. He says, uh, he says, ooh, my nuts. <laughs> I thought that's the... <laughs> oh, my nut. I Maybe it's not. <laughs> it's, uh, uh, I remember Grant Kirkhope was uh, talking about that. He's really funny. So, yeah. Now we're a little termite guy. I, I always thought it was just an ant. But I guess the termite makes sense. Because they're in here, uh... Causing all this, uh... Oh, whoops. I meant... They're making this, uh, mountain. I suppose. Ooh, this music very chill. But yeah, um, as a termite, you can clean onto the walls. I remember always having trouble with this, too. Back in the day. <laughs> but let's try our very best. Go ahead and just jump to this other platform. Uh-oh. Hey. Where'd you get those shorts? What are those? I need them. You found all 100 notes in this world. Well done. Thanks, Bottles. Oh no. Okay, thankfully, if you fall here, it doesn't like take you all the way down or some nonsense like that. That would have been awful. I'm going a little too fat. Oh gosh. Yeah. I'm so sorry. But yeah, these guys see my shorts and they're like, dude, I need this. So you gotta stay away from them. Even though we're fellow termites, they don't get- See, like, it- <laughs> It seemed like I should have made it. Okay. Oh, 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 we made it. We made it. First try. Give me those that cool backpack or else. No. But that's my friend in it. Hey. Okay, we made it to the top of the mountain. Took me quite oh yeah, the one tempting one, man. I remember always seeing this be like, should I get this? But I think we can risk it. Okay, wonderful. Hut two, three, but let's be very careful, dude. And here it is, the final jiggy of Mumbo's Mountain. And there you go. We got it all, dudes. Yay. So, let's go ahead. Just you totals here. Mumbo's Mountain. Yeah, we got everything in just under 20 minutes. Beautiful. Yeah, I think uh, originally you want to bring the termite. There is fall damage in the game, but not for the termite. You want to bring the termite to this. Right. That's how you get it. I just kind of skill shotted it before. Oh wow, it's so fast too. So now that we got everything in this level, we're gonna go ahead, I want this, and we're gonna head out and get that one um, jiggy that was on top of Mumbo's Mountain's uh, tower. All right, head on through, and we can go up here. And got to maneuver our way up, and there we go. Another uh, lair thing. What are you doing here? You weren't here before, you silly. Check this out. So then we go out. Momo's magic get weak. Animal turn back. Or magic go. And then we go. Magic all gone. Must go back to bear and bird now. So yeah, you, you can take it out of the level, but not very far. And then that's about it for Banjo Kazooie today. Alright. Wow, we did very good. That went by a lot faster than I thought it would. Oh my god, I'm getting my Grintilta on, aren't I? <laughs> How silly. 
Well, dudes, thanks for watching. Uh, is this game fun? It's just a nice... I thought it'd be just a cool, nice little chill thing that we could hang out with. And I've been wanting to show it off for a while. Because it's uh, one of my favorite games from back in the day. Alright, so next time, we're going into another level. And we're going to explore more of the lair. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.